right so now how to convert to the binary number system this is what we're gonna learn in this video okay uh, here uh, we'll try to convert how binary can be converted into decimal okay suppose uh, maybe in the previous video we uh, took a binary number something like 1010 and how we can convert that to the decimal that we discussed how we can essentially do we'll number it from 0 1 2 3 uh, if you wanted to convert this 1010 into the decimal we will pick each digit okay and we will since we need to convert this to the you know uh, binary to decimal what we do we will take the two okay because we are converting this to binary to decimal two and the place value of this one which is three okay plus zero i'll pick zero which is next digit and and i will give uh it's there in two raised to power two and one into two raised to one and zero i am pick and two raised to zero this is how we do okay two cube is eight and anything is zero this is also zero so we don't need to worry about one into two which is 2 so total it is it is 10 so this is i converted this 1010 which is there in binary to the decimal which is 10 in base 10 system so now suppose if i ask you uh, if i give 10 to you directly and i want this format how you can do this is this is how if i ask okay what you go what you what you do okay i know my answer should come like 1010 okay so this is how i need to arrive but now how i convert this decimal number to the binary number system that we gonna see here okay first what you need to do this this is very easy method first you take 10 okay and you need this in binary number system right so what you need to do you start dividing this 10 continuously uh, with 2 okay or it's something like uh, binary factorization i can say okay every time i am dividing with two okay what i will do uh, and every time whatever the reminder that you get that you should note down okay whether it is zero or one okay you will try to understand now so i will divide this 10 with by two two fives are 10 i am getting zero as reminder i need to note here okay next again i will divide this five by two i will divide two twos are four okay okay two twos are four Correct, right? I'll get one as reminder. I'll note down that. Okay. And again, I'll divide with two. Okay. Two ones are two and I'll get zero as reminder. Okay. So now, so the binary equivalent of this 10 is taken something like this. One, zero, one, zero. You need to start writing something like this. This is the binary equivalent of the 10 base 10. This is how. So you can do the same for any other number. I'll I'll let's take one more example. Suppose if you wanted to convert 32, which is binary, uh, which is a decimal number, and you wanted to convert that to the binary number system. Okay, base two. How you can do? Essentially, you will write this 32, and you start dividing. Every time you need to divide it by two until unless it become one. Okay, you get one. So start dividing it. Okay, two 16s are 32. Zero as reminder. Okay, next you need to divide this by 10 to right to 8 to 16 and you get 0 as a reminder again and you start dividing with 2, 2, 4 the 8, 0 again as a reminder, 2, 2 the 4, you are getting 0 as a reminder again, 2, 1 the 2 and you are getting 0 as a reminder. So now you need to start from this to here. Okay, so now this 32, okay, is nothing but uh, 32 which is in by which is in decimal can be written something like 1 followed by 5 0 right 1 1 2 3 4 5, five. yeah 1 followed by 5 0 okay this is there in binary number system this is how we convert decimal number system to the binary number system okay so fine so i think this is sufficient for all of you guys okay so uh, in the last few lectures we have understood what exactly number system what is exactly place value okay we looked into different number systems binary number system decimal number system and we also looked into the concept of uh, octal number systems and hexadecimal number system right and uh, we also understood uh, how we can convert a number from binary to decimal and decimal to binary okay all these stuff we have understood i think uh, this is uh, knowledge on number systems will be rewarding when we are actually 
trying to understand the concepts of uh, bit manipulation uh, and i'm very thankful and uh, this completes the i think first chapter in the bit manipulation uh, i think which is uh, i can say this number system is basic uh, chapter or maybe foundation for this uh, bit manipulation okay in the next few lectures we'll try to understand what exactly bits bytes okay and the meaning of those uh, will be understanding and stuff like that thank you so much